Hey guys, Mike here, and we're going to be talking about max point blank zeros. Max point blank zero is the elevation and windage settings required to engage a point target from zero out to your max point blank range under ideal weather conditions, meaning no wind. So point targets are targets that we can engage by aiming center of mass of our vital zone here. So my vital zone, I use a 10 inch center of mass shot. What we need to know in order to find our max point blank range is the ballistic coefficient of our round, the muzzle velocity, and the sight height of our gun. So that's how tall our sights or our optics are above our muzzle. And we need to set our max point blank radius, so mine's five inches because it's half of the vital zone. This is good for guns that have iron sights or optics that don't have a elevation compensator, a bullet drop compensator, or a rear elevation settings. So if you have fixed backup iron sights, this would be good for that. You can still use this for your uh, sights that have a rear sight elevation adjustment. You can use it as an initial setting, and this will minimize the amount of holdovers that you have to use out to your maximum effective range. So this diagram here, we have our vital zone, all right? This dotted line is danger space, and danger space is the area from the muzzle out to our target where the vital zone will be hit by some part of our cone of fire, which is around our trajectory. So as my, as my bullets go further, they, the, rounds, the group starts to spread out, that creates a cone of fire. So at the maximum ordinate and at max point blank range, a little bit of that cone of fire is going to be out of our danger space, but with that zero, uh, the vital area, the vital zone will always be hit by some part of my cone of fire. And our line of sight is always directly on our aiming point, so we're not using any holdovers. So go to jbmballistics.com, use one of their calculators, and you can find out the max point blank range for your rifle.